Hello, welcome back. In this lesson, we're going to focus on the following question. How do human activities that affect water, air, and land impact ecosystems? Lesson objective. Students learn important scientific terminology used in studying environmental impact and practice using this vocabulary. Introduction model. Over the next several lessons, you will read about a habitat for flamingos and some of the decisions the town near the habitat are making. You will have to inform, form an opinion about the best decision for the town to make. You will do the following. 1. Read about the flamingos. 2. Compare two habitats. 3. Think about the potential impact of human actions on the habitat. 4. Prepare to debate. 5. Engage in a debate. 6. Write an argumentative essay about the topic. You are here. Step 1. Read about the flamingos. Answer the following questions based on your prior knowledge. Prior knowledge means that knowledge that I already have before reading about flamingos. The first question asks me, have you ever seen birds flying together as a group? Why do you think that? Well, I did have I've seen birds fly together. So yes, I have seen snow geese fly together as a group and they do that as part of their annual migration. So birds do fly as a group together in their annual migration. Next question. Why do you think flamingos are such a famous bird species? I think that flamingos are such a famous bird species because they are pink and social birds. Last question. Where are the countries of Tanzania and Kenya? The countries of Tanzania and Kenya are located in Africa. Predict. What do you see in this image? On the left. In this image, I see the continent of Africa and a label pointing to a country in Africa. Based on this image and the questions on the previous slide, what do you predict you will read about today? Based on the image and the questions on the previous slide, I predict that I will read about flamingos and Tanzania and Kenya. I can also assume that flamingos are going to be found in those two countries. Independent work. Characters, Flora, Flavia, Flynn, Flo, Uncle Willie. A family of lesser flamingos is flying to their breeding ground at Lake Netron in Tanzania. Flynn. Hey, Dad, are we there yet? My wings are tired from all this flapping. Flo. And I'm hungry, as in, I could eat an entire lake of blue-green algae all by myself. Flynn. Yeah, right. I could. Yeah, right. I could. Flavio. Kids, just settle down. We'll be at Lake Natron before you know it. Flo. Why can't we just stop now? Points. Look, there's a really cool lake right there we could call home. Yeah, she's right. If we start heading down now, we could make a real impact with an awesome splash landing. Flynn and Flo aren't serious, are they, Flavia? Could our very own offspring not understand what fantastically fussy creatures we are, flamingos? Flavia, I, Flora, have we failed in our fundamental job of teaching them how to avoid the threat of extinction? Have we not instilled in them the importance of preservation? Hold on, hold on, kids. You're worrying your mother and me. Oh, for something new and different. So, Flynn and Flo, why do you think we're moving to Lake Natron? Because we can? Because you and Mom like it there. It's where you met. And where we were born. Well, all of those things are true, but there's so much more to the story. We couldn't just plug down in any old habitat and be happy and healthy. The conditions at Lake Natron are op optimal for birds like us to breed. Lovely freshwater springs that flow into the salt lake so we can drink and wash up. Perfect mud for making perfect nests. Private nesting sites that every new flamingo mama needs. Imagine trying to relax when there are intruders nearby. Honey, I think the kids are old enough to know. 
to hear about what happened at Lake Magadi. Oh dear, such a sad story. But I think you're right. I'll call my brother. William! William T. Flamingo! Come flap with us. At your service, sis. What's going on? Hi, Flavio. Hi, kids. Flavio and I think it's time for your niece and nephew to hear about what happened in 1962. Summarize the main points from the science theory you just read using the following format. Somebody. Who are you talking about? I am talking about a fl family of flamingos who are on their way to Lake Natron. Wanted. What does the person want? The two young flamingos are tired of flying and want to land. But what was the problem? The older flamingos don't want to land just anywhere because of something that happened in 1962. So what did they do to try to solve the problem? The flamingo family will keep flying to their destination and will explain to their young the reason they cannot just land anywhere to rest. Thanks for watching. See you next time.